Hi my friends, today we model this interesting part which has sloped all the faces and an interesting internal combination of volumes. You can add also an emboss. Yes, but this will be not important. The drawing is this one. You see how it looks and all dimensions. This is a detail of this circle to understand what are these dimensions. There are some sketches. This one is uh, the first one. Okay. Let's start. Standard millimeter IPT, the plane XY, and a contour with that sloped face. We place the center point on the center point. We apply 30 degrees here. 30 is also this face and 25 is this vertical. We have a fully constrained sketch and we extrude symmetrical on 30. Okay, this is the first volume. Then we want to apply this uh, sloped faces. 10 degrees here and 15 degrees in the other uh, view. To do this we use uh, the tool draft. We select the default option fixed edge and inventor waits for us to select the pull direction. Pull direction is this one and now inventor goes here what is the face to be draft? This is the face. Take care, you don't select here, but down, because we want to have a uh, sloped uh, face inside up. The angle is 10. 10 degrees. And OK, you see the sloped face. Also 10 degrees is this face. We apply draft, we select this edge, not this one. Then the face, this is the face. And the angle is 10. OK. If we take a look from here, we see vertical faces versus sloped faces. This face must be sloped at 15 degrees. Draft, we select this edge to be up, we select this uh, face selected at the bottom 
and we apply 15 degrees okay the other face is also at 15 degrees draft we select this edge oriented up we select the face from the bottom and the angle is 15 okay very good now we apply some fillets you see radius 6 radius 6 is on the small uh, face and radius 5 radius 5 on the uh, height face or tall face then we apply radius 3 around this face let's do this this is 6 together with this then plus 5 of this and this then plus 3 for this upper contour now we see that uh, there is a, a volume inside this whole volume without uh, this uh, uh, feature only external and dimension is 0 0.8 we apply shell shell of 0 0.8 all over but not at the bottom you see okay this is the result now we have to apply this uh, ribs the hole will be later but this must be created now we create this uh, contour dimensions diameter 8 is this cylinder and uh, 1 is the thickness of the rib with an angle here later okay let's do this we turn back the part and we apply sketch circle this is the center 8 millimeters then we draw two lines between these two edges horizontal and also horizontal distance is one millimeter one then we place this about in the middle but not symmetrical why because we use a split split the circle and split the lines and we select uh, this two segments these two arcs to make them construction now i know that this is a segment yes i place the midpoint of the segment aligned with the center point same up we draw a line between these two edges vertical line another one 
dimension one millimeter taken from the previous from this okay then I move not symmetrical to see what is here split the circle up and down and the lines up and down then I select to the left these two segments shift pressed select to the left and construction now I place on the same vertical the center point with this midpoint good if you take a look here you see also radius 2 let's apply radius 2 fillet 2 is by default and we apply to each of these 8 corners Good. Finish sketch. Extrude this to the part, but applying a taper of one degree. You see, if you take a look from here, you see that uh, there is a difference. Oh, I didn't apply here once again double click on the sketch fill it this to then extrude with the, to the part which means in this direction and taper of one okay good let's apply also here the fillets as you can see here yes two millimeters also there fillet two is by default and I apply to each edges. Okay. Now, this hole, this diameter of six and uh, radius three with nine. We use the plane XY for a new sketch F7 line vertical line to here then I keep press the left button and I go to the left and down then vertical to the button and close here this is a center line and we have two dimensions one is three and the other is nine finish sketch revolve with cut okay you see the ribs and uh, fillets now let's see what is the volume i properties physical update copy close drawing double click 
and the new value is exactly the same my friends cancel I don't change this value okay now I want to have this uh, aspect yes to do this I apply the material which is uh, ABS plastic and the uh, the aspect is dark green, dark gray. You see, I change this to be simple shaded, and now we don't see any difference between the two. Good, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.